Should I be considering UK on a student visa? What's the process of getting a PR after the student visa? Will I get any sponsored jobs after PSW? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Harris and if this is the first time you're seeing me, I share practical solutions and practical advice with all the newcomers in UK, be it on a student visa, be it on a skilled worker visa or on any other visa status. This channel's purpose is to spread optimism and share practical solutions with all of you. The answers to all the questions which I asked at the start of the video is mindset. How positive you are thinking or how negative you are thinking. Right, I'm in front of my whiteboard to give you a quick demonstration of how mindset works. Don't worry, this is not another university boring class, but it's important that you get this concept right. So what do we have here? So we've got positive mindset on x-axis and then we've got success on y-axis. And what I'm basically trying to demonstrate here, the more positive thinking you have, you're basically increasing your chances of becoming successful. The both elements are directly proportional to each other. If one goes up, the other one goes up as well. And this is tried and tested principle. It has helped me in my career, be it my job search, be it my studies, be it managing my stress. Because when I was student, I was multitasking different aspects. I was multitasking my job. I was uh, taking time out for my studies and having a positive mindset definitely helped me. Let's look at negative mindset. So the way negative mindset works, you've got negative mindset on x-axis and then you got success on y-axis. And the way those two elements work, if you are thinking negatively uh, and your negative mindset is increasing, you're basically decreasing the other element. That's why these two are inversely proportional. The more negative mindset it is, the less chances of you becoming successful increases so you are basically decreasing your chances of becoming successful because you are having a negative mindset the more it is the less this is so basically the more this direction the less this direction and you are basically decreasing your chances of becoming successful so our mindset is key and i have been noticing a lot of youtube content uh, where people are interviewing new students and they are asking them aap pashta rahe ho na is se chalo uk ta wahan mehnat kar lete yahan pe to job aapko milegi nahi agar 100 banda class mein hai to wo sirf 30 ya 15 bando ko apna sponsor job dete hain ya you have to come out of that mentality if you have worked your skill sets aap leke dikhao aap leke dikhao job in sabko you know that's that's the attitude i will have perhaps if i would have been in your shoes main ek naya student aaya hu to mera to ye attitude hoga hai i will prove them wrong इसलिए हमेशा ये जो नेगेटिविटी है ना इससे बचो प्लीज़ बचो ये जो टेस्ला का ओनर है इलॉन मस्क सब इसके पीछे पड़े हुए थे इलेक्ट्रिक कार्स नहीं बना सकता इलेक्ट्रिक कार्स नहीं बना सकता आज दुनिया को रूल कर रहा है उसका क्या है उसका माइंडसेट था भाई कि मैं पॉजिटिव सोचूंगा और आगे निकलूंगा ये जो प्री कंसीव्ड आइडियाज़ हैं हम सब के माइंड में ये कभी नहीं हो सकता ये कभी हो ही नहीं पाएगा उन सब को तोड़ूंगा सब लोगों को उसने रॉन्ग प्रूफ किया यार एंड लुक एट हिम वेयर इज राइट ना ऑल आई एम सेंग इज समीनियर डज नॉट हैव टू बी अर रियालिटी I'm not saying be disrespectful to them listen to them but have your mind at more positive side as opposed to be thinking negatively all the time because that will help you in your future having a growth mindset now let's look into the practical reason why I'm saying UK could be a better option for you to either come on a student visa or perhaps on a skilled worker visa look after brexit there is a shortage of skilled workers that's a b For students, PSW is not going anywhere. I don't see it going anywhere in next three to five years. That will allow you to have work permit under your belt for two years, and then after two years, you can always apply for a sponsor job. And when people say that you will not get a sponsor job, I don't get that. I just don't buy that theory. If you have worked on your skill sets, if you have improved your communication skills, if you can demonstrate to the company that you will bring value to their company, why wouldn't I, as an employer, why wouldn't I hire you? If I know you can bring value to my company based on your CV, based on your studies, based on your skill sets, I will definitely be giving you a, a sponsor a job. And, and it also comes down to your negotiation skills. Let's say you go for an interview, you like the company, they like you, it goes really well, and they make you an offer. Let's say if the job salary is 40K, what you can do afterwards, you can negotiate with them. You can say to them, look, I'm more than happy to come on 35K and then extra 5K you can put towards the visa application because I need a uh, sponsored visa. And if I know you are the right candidate and you will bring value to my business, uh, as an employer, I would be more than happy to invest 5K in you because I know I can get that investment back. 
um, for any company, if they're investing into something, there's a return on investment. And for me, as an employer, return on investment is that I will get you to sign a contract of two, two years so that you stay with us and you're not allowed to leave us. I don't mind spending extra 5K or 6K if I have to for your visa application because I know that's an investment for me uh, from company's point of view and I will get that return back. And people have done that, you know, they completed their PSW and they secured a sponsored job opportunity. It's not like it's, not, it's never been done. It can be done. And if it, it can be done once, it can always be done again. Lastly, have small objectives. Do not think way too much about the future. As long as you're completing short-term goals, that will give you a positive momentum towards your long-term goal. And eventually you will achieve your long-term goal. Stay positive, keep grinding. On that happy note, Allah Hafiz.